How's it going everyone? We're back with our cricket career mode. My name's Dean. I'm sure you're aware of that by now if you've tuned in to episode number 80 something. Uh, and we've got some Pakistan uh, Super League action here. Before we get into an actual tour of Pakistan as the Australian side. Now remember, we are the captain here. I wonder if we should just like open the batting? Give it a go. So I'm not quite sure if this is the finals yet of this, uh, but obviously it is a fairly important game, I think, at the back end of the season. Karachi versus Keta. So we've lost the toss, we're gonna be batting first, which means I'll be out to open. All right, Guptill on strike, first ball of the match. T20 action yep. here in Karachi. Oh, that could be a run out first ball. <laughs> Jeez. God, that was silly for me. He literally hit it straight to the fielder and I've just run out our, uh, yeah, no, look, he's shaking his head. That is entirely my fault. God, that was really silly. No run. Short ball. Pulled it away for four. That's the start we were looking for, not the run out. I should have just faced up first. That's a full toss, and that is absolutely hammered. You can't bowl anything full. Also, this guy's bowled four deliveries, and he's already out of stamina, Shazad. That is absurd. Yes. That's in the gap. That'll be a couple. Or actually, just one, just one. The speed of Nassim Shah's quick bowling. Yep. Likely to cause a bit of panic for me, but I've managed to get some bat onto that for a couple. Should be able to turn and come back for three runs here. Now, once again, I'd like to say thank you to everyone who's tuned in the streams the last couple of nights. Um, it's been fun playing different things on, on this channel outside of yes. cricket uh, and footy. And I guess the, the reason that I do that is because obviously I do, I spend a lot of time recording cricket during the day. So I, I want to be able to calm down and relax playing something different at night. Um, so that's Rocket League or Fortnite or any other game or Lego Star Wars, uh, whatever it is. Um, it's a pleasure having you guys along yeah. for the ride to be able to enjoy that as well. That's a Nick and that's four. I definitely did play the wrong line here. Just on that, if you did want to spam any of my... Uh, emotes in the chat there for the live streams. You can join the uh, membership of the channel. It's yep. called Deanopolis. Of course, for those who have been a part of the Twitch streams for a while, would understand what Deanopolis is and what it represents. Yep. Oh, that's lovely out of the meat of the bat. And an absolutely flying start from me at the moment. 26 from 10. Oh, almost carried. That was a bit of luck. Much better over this from Shazard. Well, I'm not sure about his angle of attack. He's, he's bowling quite wide of the crease, which means it's probably likely that everything is going to be very uh, offsided, I think. Which is fine, but obviously I want to find a way to score. Nawaz now the spinner on to bowl. And we've lost our second wicket as well in the meantime. That has come and gone. That is huge. It's out of here. Yes. And again, finding the boundary with a bit of ease. Just finding the middle of the bat a lot today. Yes. Oh, bang. It's beautiful. And it's four. Another left arm spinner on as the power play comes to a close. We're two for 55. Yes. Wasim also doing quite a nice job at the other end. 11 from 12. So he's just working his way into the innings. I suppose, compared to my 42 from 19. Yes. Oh, I got that very, very fine. And dandy to the boundary. Yep. Oh, that's to the fielder this time, so that'll just be the one. But just a, a bit too leg-sided for Zahir Khan to start off his spell. Oh, I've caught up with it, and that is disappointing that I haven't managed to get enough bat onto it. Strangled down the leg side. Definitely just got a little bit of an edge onto it as well here. You can see just catching up to it. Would have thought I would have got a little bit more bat on that. But anyway, I'm at 47, it's three for 70. I think this is actually a knockout game. 
but I'm not sure. Like, this could be a, a semi-final knockout match. Hopefully it's not. 185's not a bad start. Yeah, yeah. Oh. So, none for 17 off the opening two overs. We've got just a little bit of work to do here to make sure that they're not scoring quite heavily against us. Oh, that's good. So if I can start this power play brilliantly with the ball, that would be perfect. This is really good stuff. Oh, he's come down and there's a man out there. He's hit it straight to him. The first wicket falls. It's just good bowling. I just kept putting it in the right spot, not giving him any sort of width to hit onto the onside. And I had the fielders out there on the offside for protection, and he's just hit it straight down deep cover's throat. Kalili has to go for 17, one for 18. As Jake Weatherald is the new man in. And the perfect over for me, one for one from it. Three overs gone, one for 18. Oh, catch it! Oi! That is disappointing. It was a big inside edge onto the pad. And that's in the air, but I think the fielder won't get there, will he? Oh, he's done a brilliant job to stop it. And this should be a run out. Oh, had to be quicker. Wow, what a start to the over this has been. Two possible chances. This one, I think, has gone for six. That's better. So it is a challenge, keeping it tidy. He's come down the wicket, didn't get it all of it. Again, it's just the one. A deep cover fielder was almost in the game again. It's been nine runs this over. And that's what it will end with. One for 36. Oh, bang, bang. A couple of wickets in the next over. Three for 38 at the power play's conclusion. I'm gonna keep this field because I'm bowling very well with it at the moment and they're not able to get me away. Yep. Once again, they'll just pick up the one. If they want to, surely bowlers in and I'll be able to run him out. Come on, quick. Ah. This has still been a pretty good over. There's only been the four from it with one ball to come. So I've been very tidy in the opening power play and then, oh, that's a wide. I was gonna say, and then my third over, quite early for a spinner to do that. As this is whipped to the leg side for a boundary. So that wide has come back to haunt us. Five runs they get at the end there, and it's worth nine runs the over. So it was a tidy one, and it turned into a, a bit more expensive one. As Andre Russell is now in. You like bowling to him. Stop that. Nice fielding. Keeps it to one. But at the moment, it really is... Us all over them. Yep, yep. Oh, that's a good shot. And I hate when they play that sort of a shot. But well fielded. Has kept it to two at the moment. They'll get three. So still saved a run. Gee, disappointing. One more wicket would be absolutely crucial here. Yep, yep. Because then they're five yep, down. Yep. They still would need about 10 or 11 and over. And it really puts the game in a tricky position. For them. I mean, they're already what appears to be behind the eight ball and the last ball of my spell. He's just dabbed away down the third man for a single. So I finished with one for 26 for my four overs. That's pretty good, I would say. Four for 68 after 10. All right, it's 29 from 12 required now off the last two overs. Yep, yep. Very doable, but we need uh, obviously some pretty tight, tight fielding. Well, seems going to bowl one over. Who's going to bowl the next? Sorry, no, don't mean that. So it's 22 from 10. I can deep covers where he's probably going to try and aim. Oh, this is high. There's a man underneath it. I've just changed the field, and it's a worked. We pulled out a wicket. It's a big moment. Six for 163. Once again, similar change in the field to Nawaz, who is probably the key wicket now. 
Goes through the offside, just a single. That's so okay. Oh, that was mine. I've probably stepped the wrong way. I think I went right when I should have gone left. Oh, keeper's end. Good throw. So that's going to be a single. They'll need 17 from the last over. Six for 168. And this bloke, Ilias, who's gone for 12 runs from his three overs. Supreme. Hopefully he can bowl some nice stuff here to keep us to a winning performance. Oh, it's an edge. Stop ball. Beautiful. Another edge. This time it races away, but well fielded in the deep. Keeps it to two. They're going to need 15 from four. Oh, this should be a run out. Oh, they've done that very well. Oh, and that's in the gap. That's four. So the new man, Kamal, has got it to, what, 10 from three. They couldn't lose it from here, could we? Oh, it's in the air, and it's not in the gap. It's a single. Oh, they might get an overthrow here. Surely not. Nine from two. Oh, in the gap. Is it going to be four? It's not. Which means Karachi are going to go on to win. Even if they hit a six here, it provided no wides or no balls or anything, we're good. That's along the ground. It's a dot. And I think we've done it. Karachi winning by seven runs. That's a big win. He was my wicket with the ball. Very nice. And I've been earned the player of the game performance as well. How exciting. Man, that was a huge win. And now we are selected for Australia's tour of Sri Lanka as well. That is an exciting test series upcoming. I don't think we're playing in this, uh, this game. We're already in Pakistan. And also some ODIs against Sri Lanka. That's true. Oh, I'm not playing this game. Yeah, not a chance. Wouldn't have thought so. Yeah, the Vix absolutely got smashed <laughs> without me, as you'd expect. So, guys, we're on our way to Lahore as Australia will battle Pakistan in a, I think it's a two-match test series.